Hello everybody, 24 here. Welcome back to Legacy of the Dragonborn. Uh, in the last one, we took Molog's balls... <laughs> That's not what we did. We took Molog balls, uh... Offer, and now we're in Cold Harbor, so... You know, it's a give and take. But here we are. And... We're basically just exploring this waterfront district. We're basically in, like, a mock-up of the Imperial City. Uh, in Cold Harbor, and yes, nothing. I'll get to you in a minute. And we did kill that one guy in the general store. Maybe we weren't supposed to do that, but I accidentally stole from him, and he saw it happen. So he just he couldn't uh, he couldn't be alive anymore. You know, it's, it's unfortunate, but sometimes it just works out that way. You know. Well, let's see what this guy says. Huh? What you got, bro? The finest weapons and armor. Mm, I'm sure. Hmm. Wow. It's kind of cool, actually. Um. Kajiki. Wow. This is cool. I don't know if any of those are unique. Maybe someone can tell me, but hopefully I haven't wrapped it up at that point. Apotheus Helm. Oh, that's not the right thing. Thanks. All right then. Thanks, I guess. Yeah. Well, I can just make my own things too. Um, I just don't want to miss any like activate this to get a unique item. Oh, like that. See you later, bro. Hopefully, he wasn't coming to kill me for doing that. Hi. Do you remember our first encounter, Lena? All right. The sky, the, the sky was red, like here. All right, so these, I'm pretty sure these both go to the Sandman Inn, so. We'll just enter this door right here. Any of these graves have her family's name on it? I know, this is the Baptist house, okay. <clears throat> Keep our eye open for unique uniques. Search Plague Leech. Leech Fang and Human Flesh. This guy is probably dead, to be honest. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, we already have one of those. Hmm. Okay, very interesting. A drum. Is that all that there was up here? Just, uh... Some soulless remains? Alright, well. Okay. How many of those do I have? Because I feel like that's the second one I've got. Where are they? Where do those go in my things? Are they like in here somewhere? I don't actually know. Well, I mean, hopefully we come by another, unless they're in here and I'm just blind, just not seeing it. There's the eye of what's-his-face. <laughs> My glazed urn. Dancer's pipe. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing by using all these soulless remains. Maybe we're setting them free. Doubtful, but you just never know, do you? Well, we'll go into the inn. I feel like this is probably going to be the liveliest place in, in the area. <clears throat> but, but we'll see. Nope, this is pretty much empty. That's, that's great. Got 
Okay, wrong way. Hell yeah, that went pretty well. I guess we'll take that. Anything else? Hello? There's no one even in here. This place sucks. Oh, hi. Oh, Plague Leech. That'll do it. Oh, some of these have Plague Leeches on their face. <clears throat> I think that's what that is. Oh, there's a basement. Unlock coffin. No, says the coffin. Wow, okay. It's not bad. Scroll fireball. What do we have here? You trying to go somewhere, bro? Looks like you were <laughs> digging a hole to somewhere. I mean, I guess there's not much else in here unless I'm missing something, which. Well, we all know how that goes. Um. Okay, well, that was underwhelming. I guess we will go and ask that one dude how to get into the fort. Um, and maybe he'll tell us. We already know, we just gotta go up into the watchtowers. Hi, how do I enter the fort? Take the key from the captain. He's always up in one of the watchtowers. Okay. One of the watchtowers. So, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Pick a watchtower by the toe. I'm sorry that I said this joke. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Oh, God, I would kill for some garlic bread right now. That sounds delicious. Captain. Be gone, swine, or should I tear you apart? Thank you. Should we check what what's at the top of the other watchtower, or did we just get lucky? You know, it's not a big deal anymore. Don't I have a perk that stops me from taking fall damage? I feel like I do. It's one of my heavy armor perks. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> Sorry, like I said, strong drink. And I do not uh, particularly like the taste of alcohol. Like, not not really. If you do, hey, all the more power to you. Uh, I don't. So. Okay. We just picked the right tower the first time, because we are awesome. <laughs> Whee! We're going to go ahead and enter the fort. See yeah, what's going on in there. Maybe we should really quickly we'll go back to Competent Ra's house and maybe break into the apprentice houses as well. <clears throat> we should definitely do that. Let's do that first, actually. <sighs> oh, there's food cooking somewhere in this house, and it smells fucking awesome. <clears throat> Oh, 
<laughs> oh, Giovanni's. Not Campanara. That was the woman. Got anything chilling around here there, Giovanni? It does not look like it. <coughs> okay. Break into the slaver's house, because <coughs> who cares? Nice. And he's not here, unless he's... Oh. It is Sigurd of Catalina. Hide of Abbot Sirloin. <coughs> Some skuma. Some coin. <coughs> oh my god. Excuse me. God damn it. Oh, my nose is bugging. Hang on. Okay. Hello, Sir Henrik. Oh, are you freeing me? I don't even know what happened that I ended up trapped here. What a rotten luck. Hmm. Why are you here? Oh. Hmm, I don't quite remember. There was something about a slave trader and cheap booms. Oh, where's the slave trader? Hmm, when I woke up again, he was no longer here. Oh, what a bastard to lock me up in this hole. Uh, what's that about your friends? Well, we were supposed to meet at the Mafmalatu Priory. But who wants to listen to that grumpy old man there? Hmm. Good talk, I guess. Feel free to leave whenever you want. Okay, well. I guess we're gonna go into the fort. Probably have to kill some things. That does sound like... The standard, standard model. <laughs> Open sesame! Oh, nice digs. Oh, you little scamps. Un sorapi. It's fine. <clears throat> Whatever's in there is no big deal. This we have to open, though. Okay. So there must be more to right there. Hang on. Ugh, my nose is bugging so bad. Hey, oh, guys. What's going on? Guys, got some stuff down here? Wabba Jack. Oh, no. I feel like I already have seen the Wabba Jack book. I have the Wabba Jack book. It's of no consequence to me. Okay, well. Not a lot going on in this room. What do we have going on through here? What? You're weak, bro. You are weak. 
Weak sauce, weak bro bro sauce. Ow, don't fucking shoot me. Dickhead. God damn. Did he do that, or is this place just on fire now? Because Moloch Ball is just like, ah! Set everything ablaze immediately. Anything hidden under here? Some vines in the look of it. Um, but no. It does not look like it. Do. Going up. Wow, this is a tall fucking building. Hey. Oh my god. You really are just setting everything on fire, aren't you? Forbidden tome, blazing fire. I like it. All right, keep on going up. Die. Don't you shoot me. Okay. Shot me. That was to be expected. Alduin is real. Boy, you know, he sure is. Mm, yep, that looks like a plane of oblivion for sure. Deadly spikes, which I did not activate, thankfully. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Come at me. I'll fuck you up, I swear on my mum. Activate soulless remains. What does this do? Soulless remains added. Where? Soulless remains. There they are. Oh, it's a potion. Didn't even check in here. Be a weird place for the potion to be. Saint Dula's nail is also a potion. Grants one perk point. Soulless remains. Increases karma by one. When burned by the stone, when the soul burned by the stone finally burns out completely, the flesh is also burned. Increases karma point by one. I don't know what that does for me, but I'm going to use it. I'm going to save St. Dulce's Nail, because I really feel like that's useful. <clears throat> Hang on, I should probably check something real quick. Um... in case one of those soulless remains belongs on the vigilant checklist I actually kind of want to know I don't want to have to like reload I do have the old histus flask soulless remains fuck I bet I can remake it I bet it's remakeable it's fine worst case scenario hopefully I find another Ah, oh, this looks like it's going to be problematic. Let's go ahead and quick save here. Welcome, Vigilant of Stenda. Once again, my name is Vernakis. I feel like I've heard of you before. I am the Bane of Kine! You humiliated me before. 
But now, I will repay you a hundredfold! Try it, bitch. Oh my god, ow. Wait, that didn't hurt. That, that hurt a little bit. There you go. Boy, these guys sure like teleporting, don't they? Ow. Ooh, look who's dead and a dipshit. Ooh, nice bow. Take it. Key to waterfront gate. Orke's flame clutch. Wow. That's a cool ring. Piece of ball. Vernacus. Scroll of grindstone. Hmm. Vernacus and Barlor. I don't remember that guy at all. He's talking about, oh, remember me? Uh, no. No, I don't remember you. But thank you for, uh, thank you for remembering me. That's, it's, it's pretty thoughtful of you. Can go and do a little jumpy jumpy here. Whee! Hopefully, I didn't miss anything in there. If I did, mm, okay. Well, these things happen. <clears throat> but I feel like I checked just about everywhere. And now we have the key to the gate. Which is great. I'm gonna head on through. So, so you defeated Vernacus. Well, you're stronger than you look. Hey, thanks. I'm gonna go through this gate. Hopefully not die or something. Mm, although, real quick, I'm gonna go see... Oh. I'm gonna go see if it's possible to help Martha, or if she's just <clears throat> doomed to wander around doing nothing. Please, stay safe. Don't do you push any... yourself too much. Yeah, do you know where they could be? I'm sorry, but no. However, I'm certain they're not in this area. I've been searching here for years. Helpful, thanks. Well, maybe they're in this area then, you know? A lot of gravestones around. I'm sure we can find the one we're looking for. Right? <laughs> right, guys. It's actually possible, is it? No, who knows? I'm sure somebody knows. Really, at this point, I'm just looking for one of these that has anyone's name on it. <clears throat> what are the chances our friend at the Priory knows where the grave is? pretty slim, right? I mean, maybe he knows, but I doubt he's going to help us. He's kind of a dickhead. Well, that's just kind of sad. Maybe I'll ask him anyway. See what he has to say. Hey, man. And you got nothing. Thanks. Appreciate it. See you later. Good talk. Stay safe. Don't push yourself too much. Okay. Well, thanks. Thanks. Good talk, Martha. See you later. Bye. We're gonna go fucking defeat the flying worm. Which has a name that I've completely forgotten. Quick save time.
<laughs> Hello. Uh. A sand scorpion. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Hello. Bam. Okay. Well, there's something over there. We're just gonna walk right into the city. Apparently, there's supposed to be a fucking dragon to stop us. You coming? Oh, there he is. Ooh. There you are. Come here. Where's my dragon priest? You're gonna have to come down here so we can fight. Not helpful. Mentana. Come down here, you dickhead. <sighs> Let's start. Now, hopefully, when I summon this guy, it actually summons him. There we go. We can do all the fucking range damage. Come down here, you dickhead. Burger. Not burger, but, you know. Just burr and grr. Grr burr. That's something else, too. Come down here. This is the problem with using one of these melee builds. Is these dragons, they just fucking, they do whatever they want. They can come down here. Okay. Are they gonna keep fucking with you? Are they gonna land? Are they gonna hover above you like a dickhead? I'm not even hitting this asshole. But he's also not doing that much damage to me, so. Could be worse. At least land on this rock. Helpful, thanks. Maybe that'll do something for me. Does not seem like it. <clears throat> Come down here, fucking dickhead. God. Oh, my buddy's gone. Did you land? Nope, sure didn't. Land in the right spot, please. Thank you.
Come down here, you douche. Oh, he's landing. Big boy's coming down. Fuck you. Okay. What you got, bro? Altano's remains? What? Why? Is this is what happened to Altano? Huh, that's interesting. Ebony Blade of Mercy. Dragon Soul Stone. Yatmorn Mage, Jordan and Trap the Soul of Dragons into small statues. Grants one Dragon Soul. Wow. That's neato. Oh, Inquisitor Peep. What's up, bro? Thank you for killing the worm. I can finally enjoy my walks again. Yeah, you're welcome. How can I get into the Imperial City? The main gate is to the north, but it's been sealed since the invasion of the Army of Order. Mm. There is a way, though. To the northeast of the island, there is a large sewer leading to the prison tower in the city. Mm. You may want to try crawling through it. If you're lucky, it will lead you to the Imperial City. What's the Army of Order? An infinite army, led by Jigalog. It invaded a few decades ago, and began conquering the entire continent. Mm. Almost the entire empire was absorbed and destroyed by Jigalog. After the defeat in the Battle of Wei, only this island with the Imperial City remain. Countless souls have been sacrificed to maintain the barrier. But even the souls have limits. And more like Baal's power is declining. The barrier will not last much longer. Then, Grey March will overrun this wasteland and crush us all. Mm. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to talk to this guy a little bit more in the next episode, but <clears throat> until then, thank you so much for watching. I'm 2 4 and I'll catch you guys all on the flippity flop side. I did just remember that we have to go back and get into the old well. But I'll end today's work, so. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Catch you guys all on the flippity flop side. Until then, just remember to be nice to each other, okay? Okay. Bye.